keep goats back in Mombazoo, and we're doing Mombazoo type stuff. Why is there a basket down here? Do do I have four baskets? These appear to be done again. Uh, we haven't added to the mix recently um, for pots because we have dog obsessions. We need to get to the dog. How are you guys doing? Now, if everything went right, this video will have been uploaded at a completely different time than you guys are normally aware of. Basically, we've decided to change my upload time by 12 hours, roughly. Uh, somewhere in that neighborhood. <laughs> well, I guess we're going to see if it works. Basically, and I'll tell you the whole thing, YouTube has been nothing but a jerk lately. And I'm blaming them 100% for not fixing the problem. Basically, if you've ever used, ever uploaded a video to YouTube, cons or videos to YouTube consistently, I'm just going to go like this, I think. Um... You'll know that every so often you'll get a day where it'll say, hey, when we're done processing this, it'll be uploaded and we'll have to process the standard definition and then the high def version and then, then we'll be ready to go. And and then you're like, whoa, thanks, bud. And so then you're all happy about it. And then but then it never happens. Like it'll just continually say processing, processing, processing. And last night's video, for example, I tried to upload uh, Sunday's video, the farming sim video, and it took, uh, you know, a normal upload time, which for me isn't that long. And I had to upload it five times or actually books does the uploading, but she had to upload it five times, four times, five times to get it to actually eventually function. And it took 14 hours. So what I'm trying to do is bake in some extra time. I missed one. Bake in some extra time there. <laughs> so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, anymore. There we go. Perfect. Thanks, bud. Okay, this is good. This is 10 grand right here. Okay, excellent. All right, so that's good. How is this doing? So yeah, that's that's where that's why it's stuff is changing. Um don't worry about it. You know, don't have a panic attack. I know how I know how you people get. <laughs> There's definitely a tendency to want to panic when things change. Uh it's not gonna be too different. It'll it'll work itself out very quickly. Uh, and you'll, you will see and everybody will be happy. Excellent. Thank you. And you can be filled up. There we are. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So this is done. Oh, we got to replant. Um, now that we, okay. Where are the seeds? There they are. Oh God. This is, there's so much dog to find. So basically regarding the dog. So apparently after you talk to Melanie, uh, she then marks it on your map. What, what human being marks a dog's location on a map? Like that's weird, man. So anyway, I never thought to check the map because it didn't seem like a like one thing for a physical object, but something that moves around just doesn't seem like again, if it's like a herd of buffalo, yeah, okay, yeah, they, they congregate in this area, but the dog, really? And then to never mention that you put it on the map here, I'll mark your map for you where I saw the dog last. That 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 would make more sense to me. But she didn't, and so I didn't know to even check the map. So we're gonna check the map once I'm done replanting this trash. But I couldn't leave it. I was going to wait another day before I did another episode, but I was like, I need to know about this Doug. I get worried about Doug's being alone and lonely. Makes me sad. You ever get that feeling you watch one of those videos and like in the arms of an angel plays by Sarah McLaughlin and you're just like, Ugh. yeah, that's the way it is for me. But how are you guys doing, by the way? Happy holiday season. Uh, you know, I'm not sure. Uh who or what you believe. So I'm just going to say happy holiday season <laughs> from, from the goat, whatever you uh, want to do this season. That's great. Um, I plan on doing a lot of napping. <laughs> I got a week off. So, and that's rare for me. Excellent. Okay. <sighs> We're getting so low on poutine. Things are not going well here. I, I, it's what, 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 what is a good dog hunting? Well, not hunting, I guess, finding red shirt, you know, classic. Cla okay. This is becoming problematic <sighs> when you just don't have enough poutine, you know? The bears, the bears, the bears. So let's check the map here. Mm. Oh, there he is down by down past the river on the other side of the racetrack. Oh, the devil's corner down there. Okay. Yeah. So we'll go that way and find him, but we're going to disconnect. No, it's already disconnected. Nice. All right. Excellent. Let's get in. Okay. We got all the dog treats. Um, all of them. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Now. Normally, I would say, hey, let's go get the maple syrup first, but it's already 320 and I don't care. So <laughs> we're going, 
Oh, you know what? No French. Oh, no. We know what we need. We do need to head down there right now. Because I have poutine in the car. That's fine. But I got to get some maple syrup for myself. Because I'm, I'm a little thirsty, apparently. So I'm just going to park the truck on the road. Leave it idling for now. And I'm just going to run and grab some real quick. Because getting through here is a pain. And then I always miss the turn and end up in the ditch. It's a, it's a whole thing. Shut up. It's a whole thing. <laughs> Don't you freaking judge me. Oh my god, what happened? What happened? Oh yeah, I gotta go pick up empties, don't I? We are 100% out. Oh, great. There. Here, just fill that back up, would you? Thanks. Yeah, we're gonna have to grab the empties on the way back from uh, harassing the dog. Let's see. It's just, it's been, it's been a day. Okay, let me see. Um... Yeah, we're going to have to go pick up 12, and we can fit 12 in the truck, so I'm not super concerned about that, but we're going to have to probably do it in the middle of the night. By the time I get to that dog and bat, it's going to be a whole thing. we got to hurry. All right, so let's uh, take that off, and we'll turn this around. Flip, flip a bitch here. Okay, here we go. There we go. Perfect. Now, somebody said when I hit the tree the other day that it was because I transitioned from this to the, the con uh, to the asphalt. Uh, for the gravel to the asphalt. That's not what it was. I hit a bump. Something dug in for like no reason and it was a problem. Because I, I do that drift all the time and it's never had that problem. Like it'll it'll snap a little bit but not like that. That was like it bounced and that just doesn't happen to me. <laughs> Unless they've changed the map. Which I doubt they have. Yeah, so like that was a little strange. Like there's nothing there. <laughs> See? It's like sometimes the truck seems to pass through the world just slightly. It does it in the long drive too. Where the truck will just pass through the world just ever so slightly. Excellent. Okay. Oh yeah, if we can grab curd on the way home too, that'd be smart cuz we're down to 400 curd, which is not a lot of curd in the world of poutine. Yeah, we're definitely um, somewhat ignoring our responsibilities to the maple syrup. but we And, and we haven't added to our uh, underground bunker yet in, in recently, but I can't help it. There's dogs. Like, what do you want from me? I'm, I'm just a man. <laughs> you know, I could have went the other way, I guess. But this will work. So if we, we cross the bridge and it should be around there somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Come on, baby. Oh, no, no thanks. No thanks, guy. And please, I don't want to hit the ditch today. Okay, so we don't want to run into anything. Like trees or ditches or whatever else is out here. Man, it only does 100 miles an hour, eh? Not very fast, but it'll do. Now, apparently the dog can get scared fairly easy. So it's just across here. All right, let me just double check the map here. Yeah, it's just across this way. Oh, here we go. Look. Oh, look at this. There's dog treat bags. Okay, hang on. What do you think? Fish or beef? Beef. Let's get beef. Okay. Poisson? Le bouffe. Okay. Doggy. Watch out for dogs. Okay, I got this. <gasps> Empty tree bags. Leo, are you out here, bud? Oh. Oh, here he comes. <gasps> He's a German Shepherd. Hi, buddy. What are you doing, Leo? <gasps> You're so cute. I know, but it's scary. You look like a dog I had, or not a Well, actually, yeah, you look like a dog I had too, but a dog I used to know when I was growing up. His name was Cecil. Oh, yeah, there we go. Bye, Leo. Oh, my goodness. That was great. Is he on my friends list now? <gasps> where is it? Mm, where, uh, where? Oh, no. Gen no, this isn't right. Oh, friend. Leo, one of 50. Okay, treats given today. Yep, we did it. Oh, not petted today. Well, I can't pet him today because he, he, took, he took my treats and he left. Now, can I do more than one? Or is it like you can only do it like once a day? I'm assuming it's once a day. 
Buddy, are you coming back for more? No, I look like it's once a day. So we got to come out here once every day now and feed this dunk. Excellent work, Leo. I am impressed with your abilities to want to come and hang out with me. All right, so let's go pick up our supplies and we'll come back and visit Leo again. Oops, perfect. Oh, oh, that's a ditch. Ooh, real close. <laughs> All right, all right, Leo, I'll be back tomorrow, probably, unless something happens, uh, and we will drop off more treats for you so you don't starve to death. No, I don't know what happens. What? <laughs> what was that? What happened? Okay, well, that's fine. Do we still have our stuff? Most of it, anyway. All right, I think we're good. Holy sugar. Well, that was that was intense. That is that is way more intense. Than it needs to be. I'll tell you that much. Okay, excellent. So, <laughs> that, wasn't a, that wasn't a good time. <laughs> oh, goodness sakes. Okay, come on, truck. This poor thing, man. I've beaten on it so hard. And this, this vintage of Chev truck is terrible. So, like, like, if this is original and there's been no modifications, which I'm assuming, uh, these are not great. You don't want, you don't want to beat on them like this. Okay, I'm here, buddy. Okay, hey, buddy. Okay, let's see here. There's only five here. Now, that's not great, but it's better than nothing. So we'll take these home, and we'll fill them up when we get home, because we need to. And this is what I get. This is what I get. I, I got dog obsessed. This happens to me every time there's dogs in a video game. It's the same way. Like, I played Fallout 4. You remember Fallout 4? And you, you run into the dog, dog meat, very early in the game. Um, I think it's like at the gas station or something. And, whoa. And from that point forward, he was the only um, person I brought with me. I never used any of the other uh, uh, people, like the, what do you call it, companions, I guess? I, I never used another companion. <laughs> All I ever used was that dog. And I, and I know he wasn't the best, but it's just like, I don't know, something cool about hanging out with my dog. I was okay with that. I want to go home and sleep so I can go go bring more treats to Leo. Which is cool because I can do it in the morning when I drop off the, the Murple Circle, man. Okay, here we go. Slow her down, slow her down. Look at all the junk I leave laying around here regularly. Okay. I noticed I was a bit low on fuel. Ah, caught it. Okay, almost broke that glass. You see that? All right, here we go. All right, and we'll grab this. And I like that we can just fill up whenever we feel like it. This is a uh, this is a great time. We got one hundred sixty eight thousand dollars. Jeez, whoever thought I'd make one hundred sixty eight grand in Merple Circle in a year? Okay, here we go. Because this has literally been a year since the first time I played it. Oh, wait a minute. I played it on the the first video I ever released was the seventeenth of December, if I remember correctly, because I'm always a day behind because of my release schedule. So that worked out great. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Did we did we lose one? No, we're good. We still got five. Alright, let's get this home. Okay. Home again, home again, jiggity jig. Uh, should we check the mail? I don't feel like I need to. I really should, shouldn't I? Uh ever since we got on grid power, it's just always been a constant battle for me. Do you check the mail? Do you not check the mail? How often should I check the mail? Nobody really knows. All right, let me see. People say they know, but they don't really know. Why is there never any curd here anymore? Did they move where the curd comes from? I'm a little bit concerned about the amount of curd that's been floating around lately. That's like a whole bunch of times that, well, oh my God, I'm going to run out of poutine. I know it. Oh, God. Oh, God, please don't let me run out of poutine. See, this is what I was worried about. I'm just going to run. I'm going to have to buy poutine every day now. I'm going to buy four a day every day. This was the concern the whole time. I'm pretty sure it's been several days since I've seen curd. And it's kind of freaking me out, man. Like... Like, how, how how long can you go curdless? I can buy potatoes. 
Am I just gonna have to sell French fries now? Is that is that what's gonna happen? And then have to buy my cur my 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 poutine like like a like a pleb like I ugh. oh my god ugh, I'm so worried about it oh god oh god okay I'm becoming very concerned about the level of curd that I have just hang on barrels hang on buddy we got this okay jump this a little bit there we go let's uh there we are ugh. This is barely going to drain any of it, honestly, because I can hold four in the, in this here alone. So <laughs> this isn't going to drain hardly any of this. On you go, please. There you go. Go for it. Perfect. All right. I'll grab another one while we're waiting. I said another, another one. Okay. Here we go. Perfect. Are you full yet? Oh, you're getting there. Nice. Now heat up a little bit because we can always drink some purple purple, man. Oh my god, it's so slow. Perfect. And then you can go under there. Perfect. It should be the speed up time now, I think. It's after seven. Oh nice, here we go. Oh, that's full already. Jeez. That fast uh spout combined with uh the speed of, sped up time of day really fills that stuff up quickly. Look at that hundred percent already. Boom. It's a good thing they added it, too, because there's some people out there that have massive maple syrup farms. Ooh, look at my truck at night. <laughs> All right. Oh, that's 100% full. And then uh, we should be able to put that in there. All right. Now, we should be able to just load the truck, bring it back to the house. Oh, no, wait a minute. We should let that one fill up overnight. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go sleep. Oh, no, the bear's. God, this is like the water looks so good at night from a distance. It really does. Like the way that the moonlight reflects off it. Ah, excellent. I don't want to lose your love tonight, stupid bears. Okay. Was this ready? Oh, I wonder if I can just leave it until the other ones are ready to harvest. Okay. Bears, bears, bears. Okay, let's have a nap. Ah. Amongst the Poutine. It's my new book. <laughs> That'll be the name of my memoir. Love Cowboy, Amongst the Poutine. Okay. We got to go back to bed because it's not time to get... There we go. Perfect. Okay. Today's the day. Today's the day we go pick up the syrup. Go, go feed the dog. Come back. Well, no. Let's see. Drop off the syrup. Feed the dog. Come back. Get the empties. Um, maybe we bring the trailer so we can also grab, uh, now, you know what? We do pretty good picking up the, uh, the under, what are those things called? The planters pretty well. Oh, look at this. This went through most of this already. Nice. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to get this stuff to go, please. All right. Let's just full. Yeah. Oh, they're going to almost filled that up. Okay. Let's get this in here. Now that these have different weight values than they used to. Excellent. Perfect. Uh, hopefully I get to um, Hydraneer tonight and do a stream again. I've been having a lot of fun streaming that game. I don't know what it is about that game, but I'm I'm McDonald'sing that one. I'm loving it. Okay, here we go. Dude, oh. Okay. Oh, I know why. Something's blocking the door. What is it? Is this this poutine? Okay, let's try that. Perfect. Okay. Just wondering why that was doing that. Okay, let's see. So I can see the barrels. Oops, that's not right. Okay. I don't know the button for turning off the parking brake, so <laughs> I just do it manually. Oh, no. Oh, look at this. Just hanging that wheel. Did you see that? Nice. If you've ever seriously off-roaded, you know exactly what that feels like, and it's nerve-wracking. <laughs> If you've ever hung a wheel, you know exactly what I mean, and you know how scary it is. And all these supposed tough guys out there, oh, I wasn't scared. Yeah, you were. You're a liar. It's okay to be scared. That's normal. In fact, I find people who are scared are, are scared are usually the most brave people you meet. They know when to be scared, but they just know how to push through the fear. That's true bravery, not pretending you're not afraid. Ugh. See, I have thoughts on things. <laughs> I'm not just I'm not just a mimbo. 
<laughs> I'm not just good looking. I'm also smart. No, I'm kidding. I'm not. I'm not all that smart, as, as people probably know. And I was in a gifted children's class. Can you believe that? <laughs> it's not even a joke. It's totally true. Okay. Whee! Let's break up my sense of humor from. Oh, rabbit! Okay, let's, uh. We'll drop this off. We'll go see the dog. We'll see, like, what's up, Leo? Oh, God, I can't wait till he's my best friend, because I have no friends in this other than Eric, the maple syrup guy. And honestly, he never asked me to do anything. Like, I've never once since he gave me any advice on Mel, and, and never once since he said, like, hey, you want to, like, break bread or have Merple Serple or something? Please tell me we have more curd. We don't. What What happened to the curd, man? Do we have to, like, go to a dairy farm now or some crap? Okay, there's something's up with the curd, man. I gotta go. I gotta figure that one out. There's gotta be something, something going on. Okay, excuse me, buddy. I'm just look out. I'm sorry. I, I got I got places to be. It's a purple circle emergency. All right, like we don't have time for your your maple syrup paradigm. We got dogs to find. We got maple syrup to drop off. We got we got all sorts of things in this tiny little Quebec town. It's gotten so interesting as of late. Who knew there was a dog? Uh, and it looks like a real dog, too. I thought it would be more cartoony or kind of dumb, but it looks like a real dog. Oh, oh, look at all this. Look at all this. Please stop. There we go. All right, let's just get rid of this. We don't have enough room for all those, as far as I can tell. But we can get a dozen of them in here. All right, I'll be back for those. I just got to go. Oh, you know what? I could probably just... You know what? No, no, no. I don't want to drag them out there with me. Because if I do that, I'll lose them. And I'll, I'll be, I'll be like, after hitting the bridge on the way back, yeah, it's probably best we just uh, go see Leo without it. All right, let's uh, let's kick her into gear here. Yeah, my inner, uh, like I said, I've said this before in a couple videos, but in case you're new here, I, I used to work. A buddy of mine growing up's parents, we lived in a small town, and they ran like animal control for the small town. They had a uh, a shelter and all this. So I went on a lot of calls for stray dogs, raccoons, things like that. Um, so I have a soft spot when I see an animal in distress for helping it out. We got a lot of calls for farms. Uh, you know, so like it was, uh, you know, it was a good time. I enjoyed it. Yeah. I like animals. They they add something to the... Oh, here we go. Excellent. I should probably turn the truck off. So he's not to scare. No, we gave him beef yesterday. Should we do fish today? Probably. We don't want to get him bored of the treats. Leo, I'm here, bud. He just came running out of the forest before. <gasps> okay. All right, buddy. Hi. Yeah, I know. Everything's nerve wracking, bud. Hi. I'd be cautious too. I've been known to eat people's snacks. Hi, buddy. What are you doing? Oh, oh, he's getting close. It moves like a real dog. Oh, see you around, buddy. Oh, my God. We're going to be such best friends. Okay. All right. Well, back to town. we got to get some of those things in there. I think we're going to have to put off the... Uh, well, you know, we could just do the balancing act like we do. Maybe we'll do that. Hang in that wheel. Okay, there we go. Perfect. I was going to say, yeah, like... I was going to say, we, we should probably just get the uh, the barrels and forget the planters, but I'm pretty sure, you know I get, I, I can I can balance things on here all the time. Yeah, Leo and I are going to take a while to become best friends, but when we do, I won't bother buying any more dog treats till these are gone because they're just cluttering up the truck, but I will get more dog treats soon. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. Look out. Maple syrup emergency. I need an alarm that's all like bloop, 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 maple syrup, bloop, and then I can like blow through traffic. In Canada, you need that. Like you really do. There, there's there's certain maple syrup laws that are in place. For example, take your fake maple syrup, take your Miss Buttersworth, and stick it where the sun don't shine. I don't mind it, but at the same time, uh, yeah, it's not real, and it needs to be real. If it's not real, it's not maple syrup as far as I'm concerned. All right, can we just turn this off, or is it going to roll away? It's going to probably roll away. All right, that's fine. We'll just uh, do this quickly. All right, here we go. Now, I can only fit 12 in here at any given time. 
And usually it's better to fit 10, but... Oh, no. <sighs> well, things are going to go well if that's the game you're going to play, truck. <laughs> okay. There, get in there. It's not hard to fit a lot in here. You just got to be... Make everything kind of squeeze together, which is not as easy as it sounds because they want to bounce around when they touch each other. I would rather the physics simulation just stop for a moment and then was like, huh, okay, so I'm going to move this here and that there and this will make that not fly away, but... Or just tell me I can't place it there. That's cool, too. I get it, game. You, you, have, you only have so much you can do. All right. <sighs> yeah, whenever the game tries to tell me I can't do something, like, you can't load any more than that, I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> I've heard this before. Okay, there we go. Grab this and stick this one in here. I believe we could probably get a few more in here um, with some interesting finagling like that. See, when you, when, when you get close like this and you're almost full, a lot of times this stuff doesn't come flying out. <laughs> it just kind of squishes together like that. Of course, if the parking brakes on, it becomes more of an issue. Now, this is kind of rolling away, but let's just hope it doesn't go too far. See how it stops moving when you take off the parking brake? Always park on flat surfaces, people. Okay, yep, yeah, we got that one in. Can we get this one in? Come on, baby. Oh, yes. <laughs> we got them all. Like a Pokemon, baby. Okay, let's get it. Now, we got to go pick up planters. I think we can fit them in here somehow. Excellent. This is so many barrels, man. <laughs> we got so many barrels here. We got 12, 15. We got 15 barrels in here. So don't let anybody tell you. Always reach for the stars, people. Even you can prevent forest fires. No, that's not right. You, you can cram as many barrels in here as you want. Don't let them tell you different. And don't let them tell you that you can't use the trailer because the trailer's lame. I don't know why everybody wants to use the trailer. All right, here we go. I'm going to buy this, and I'm going to buy this. I'm going to get this all home in one trip. You watch me. It's going to fall off all over the place, but we don't care because this is we're, we I will not be told how to, to move my stuff. <laughs> I might even stop to see if those curds have reappeared yet. Although I feel like they haven't. And I certainly feel like, wait a minute. Should we check the map? Hey, Mel, how are you? Yeah, I saw that. You told me that. Oh, what's this? <gasps> Dog food. Okay. Thank you very much, Mel. This is for you. As one does. Um, I'm going to get dog bowls and dog beds. and Oh, God. Books are going to have to be picked up. I'm going to get all the dog bowls. Who knows? Who knows? Thanks, Mel. I'll see you around. Enjoy yourself, eh? All right. Okay, let's see here. All right, so let's, uh, let's start stacking as one does. All right, here we go. There we go. Put this here. Yeah, I get a lot of crap that I rarely use the trailer. But the trailer's lame, and I hate it, so we don't use it. Instead, we do stupid things like this, because we can. I just think nobody out here is creative. That's what I think it is. <laughs> oh, no. That's going to fall off pretty easy. So we're going to move this over here, and that way we can back that one over there. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Could you tip? Oh, no, you're not going to do that, are you? That would be ridiculous. Okay, here we go. Put you back. Oh. Cannot be locked because it's moving. That's not your land, good sir. Yeah, see? Can't lock it to the truck. I wonder if I could lock it while at home, though. Yeah, but then it might not let me unlock it. All right, let me see here. <sighs> Perfect. And we got one more. Probably throw it in the cab of the truck. Excellent. Okay, let's. Uh, this is off. Excellent. Let's get it out here. All right. Yeah, trailers are for the weak. <laughs> there is something like there is a place in video game heck, not hell, but heck, that I'm gonna end up because of stuff like this. Like, there's got to be someone up, like, when you die, there's someone's like, okay, we noticed you played video games, and this is the result of all your stupidity. And now you're going to be... Now you're going to be stuck with having to deal with all this heck because of what you've done. Because I got all that junk in my trunk. All right, let me see. Oh, it looks like the curd came back the very next day. All right. I thought it was a goner. 
But I guess I just couldn't stay away. All right, let's see. Yes. Whoop. Okay, where are we going to put the curd now? Yeah, the curd can go in here. Yep, yeah, see? It's all working out. Whoop. Perfect. Excellent. Got to spend a lot of money today. Uh, I guess not too much. It's just been the last little bit I've spent quite a bit of money. All right, let me see here. Back to the outdoor view. There we go. Okay, yep. Just stay on there, bud. It's during acceleration and turning where it's the problem the most. And especially when it's like these tight little technical turns. Especially on the keyboard because you're tapping, right? You're not. So it, it develops a little momentum over time. There it goes. See? <sighs> And now it's all going to freak out. Don't freak out, please. Yeah, but I, I'm trying to go. Don't worry. Hopefully they come back. Oh, no. Don't, don't fall off the back. Yeah, that one's going to go off the back here any second. Come on, baby. Oh, no. Yep, we lost it. Okay, stop, please. Oh, God. Everywhere, everywhere it's falling off today, I got to put the parking brake on, which is not helping because it, it makes everything slide around. I feel like if they had some sort of device to help me transport stuff, this would be easier. But I can't think of it. Like, something that would trail behind me that would help. Yeah, but what are you going to do? It's not like they're, it's not like, it's not like they're going to, like, you know... The scientists are going to figure that one out. All right, here we go. There we go. And around here now. I'm lucky I don't live too far from town. Because this could be a little bit of an issue. Rabbit. Yeah, there it is. Oh, no, no, no bumps, please. going well though wouldn't it be awesome if they added a minivan <laughs> and i know nobody wants to hear that in a, in a game about cars but would it be great having a van oh god don't please don't please don't jeez you saw me coming thanks bud thanks you stupid son of a bitch you stupid worthless son of a bitch oh my god right out in front of me right out in front of me how am I going to clean this up now? You stupid moron. Oh, my God. I was coming down that road. You should not have pulled out on me. That is bad form, bud. Bad freaking form. Ugh. I still argue this would have been even worse if we had the trailer. Okay, yep, that's not working for some reason. Yeah. Right out in front of me. Like, he saw me coming down the road. There's no way he didn't see me. Okay, yep. Don't go on there or anything. That would be ridiculous. There's no way he didn't see me. What a piece of human trash. Yeah. For some reason, whenever I put stuff on my roof, I always put it, like, way too far to one side. I, I don't understand why I do that, but I do. Like, there, I'm doing it again. And what's weird is that it looks like it's, like, hanging over on this side, and <laughs> yet somehow it's still a problem on this side. I don't understand. All right, here we go. And then you... None of this is going to stay well at this point, so we're just going to have to kind of go for it. All right, is that everything? All right, let's go. We're not too far from uh, from base camp here, so like, what? A, what a loser, man! Just pulled right out in front of me, and then didn't even stop to help me pick up my stuff. Like, what a dick! Uh, it's just been a day, man. It's been a friggin' day. All right, here we go. Let's pull this on in here. 
There, you can fall off now. All right, excellent. Now we can get out here. We'll get these off, and then we'll go drop off the barrels, because that's the thing that needs the most attention right now. Okay. Oh, you yeah, know, I'll bring the current in, too. Oh, I keep leaving the door open. You know, those bears are going to show up, and we're all going to die. Like, I'm going to come back, and there's going to be a bear in my bedroom. <laughs> that should be a thing. If you leave your door open too many times, a bear should show up and start snuffling around. All right, and grab that. Excellent. Okay, now we'll take... Perfect. Okay. Now we'll take these back over to there. There we go. Excellent. There we are. See, it's starting to work out. Other than Mr. Yellow Dodge Ram. Typical Dodge Ram driver. They always talk about how bad BMW drivers are. Yeah. You ever watch a guy in a Ram? Give him a hemi and he thinks he's driving a sports car. Okay. 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 Come on up. Up and over. Okay. You know, I gotta say, I'm very impressed with the fact that nowadays when overlays happen, they don't show up in your recording. Like, um, my Steam overlay pops up. But I never have somebody, like, like it never shows up in the recordings unless I'm just rec recording the entire screen, which I never do, so. All right. Unless I'm, like, going to record, like, um, Windows, like, the Internet. Like, what, what are you using right now? Firefox? Chrome? I forget. Who cares? It's all the same. I don't use the Adblock software because it doesn't get in my way. So I don't, I don't have to worry about it. And I'll always tell people, like, if you do watch YouTubers and you you like them, you know, show some support. Turn off your ad blockers. That's how they get paid. If you want people to continue to make content, um, they're not going to do it if they don't get paid, right? I don't care. But <laughs> I'm not in the, if I was in this for the money, trust me, it ain't worth it. Okay, let's see here. And this can go here. Nice. I'm going to drink some of this Marble Circle because I can use it. Ugh. Are you done filling up yet? Thank you. Now yeah, we're going to get a lot today. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, this is fun. But yeah, you know, like I said, people do YouTube because they get paid to do it, right? <clears throat> if they're not getting paid, they're not going to do it. And that's just, that's the sad fact. And uh, it's like when, when people freak out about like, you know, microtransactions and games and stuff, and I just don't care. And they're like, oh, doesn't that bother you? I'm like, nah, not really. You know why? Because, you know, they want to make money. I get it. Like, it's like with Xbox recently increased, is going to be increasing the price of their games to 70 bucks. That doesn't bother me. <laughs> like, it doesn't bother me in the slightest. I know it probably should, but it doesn't. I look at the budgets of these games, and it's like, like, what is it like? I think it was, was I reading somewhere that like Grand Theft Auto 5, which is now what, 10 years old, was like $100 million to make? Like we're not making, you know, $4 million video games anymore. Or like back in the early days of Mario and all that, they'd put a game together for like eight bucks. You know, <laughs> it's, it's not the same thing anymore. And that's unfortunate, you know, but it is. It's price costs, you know, voice actors cost a lot. Artists cost a lot. So it doesn't bother me. I would rather they weren't that price, sure, but I don't care. And I play a lot of indie games, so, you know, these guys are always like, you can tell the ones that think their stuff isn't worth much. Like, the guys from The Long Drive, you can tell they're like, oh, geez, our game isn't that great, because they, they sell it for like 10 bucks. Like, those guys could make, you could pay, I would pay 30 bucks for that game. <laughs> Easily pay 30 bucks for that game. All right, this is going so friggin' well today. We have dog friends. We're getting dog friends. We are circling all over the place. I'm not sure. That sounds really dirty. <laughs> we probably got to water our potatoes. Probably. Let me check here. Oh, no. They're still. Oh, yeah. They look dry. We'll just water the potatoes. All right. Let me see here. We're going to stop you right about you know, right there. Perfect. Excellent. We got nothing in this garage anymore because I moved everything over to the, the shop. But I think. This is as good a place as any to leave it. Um, and I'll install the... Because you guys have seen me install the... Uh, 
the the planters a dozen times now or more so you don't need to see that anymore <laughs> i don't think so i'll just leave them there and i'll i'll uh before i start recording the next episode i'll do it so i will leave this here so thank you so much you guys have been super supportive the um the thank my streams have been great uh but thank you so much for watching if you like this please leave a comment maybe subscribe maybe get your friends to subscribe or your dogs to subscribe and if you didn't like this well you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I'm not much of one. Thank you again so much for watching. Love every poutine I eat. Scapegoat! I think next time I'll wear this. No, that's, that's gray. I'll wear this pink shirt. Looks lovely. Although I can't see my body, so it doesn't really matter. Out! Out!